Swimek. So this is second round of Mega Colony Gunny Colio vs. Cuba Rock. Go first. Oh yeah. Uh, the loser will decide who will go first, right? So I'm going first. Okay. Stella, Vanga. Machine worker ends. What's the go star for going on? Draw. Right. Machine hunt. Starter skill draw. What's it? Draw. Alright. Star base mirrored. Starter skill draw. It doesn't your Vanga. No. Trip. Trip on. Creep? Uh, front. Oh. Uh, damage check. Heal. Button. Standard draw. Riding. Machining Mantis. I'll use Mantis skill. Come to the last one. Top. Six cards of my deck. I can add one with three into my hand. I'll take stack into it. Mantis gets 6,000 power. Megalara Lancer 9,000 to our 5,000 No guard, damage check, no trigger 15,000 to our No guard Drive check Cyclone Tooth Damage check, critical That's it Stand and draw Assist Great 3. My Vanguard gets 15,000 power total and plus 2 drives. So it's that quadruple drive. Quadruple drive. I have no counter blast to work with. Uh, it's okay. I'll call Brawny Jerk. I'll activate Brawny Jerk's Soul Blast. Put the uh, top card of the deck. Uh, I guess 6,000 power. Put the top card of the deck into a drop zone. Great 1 operator, Soul Charge 1. Calling Spear attack mutant Mega Lara Lancer. Lara Lancer attacks your Vanguard for 9,000. 5,000. Yeah. Uh, okay, 27. No, no. Uh, 4 drives. First check, heal trigger. I can't heal, but I give the 10,000 power to Brawny Jerk. Second check, draw trigger. Power to Brawny Jerk, draw 1 card. Third check, um, Phantom Black. And last check, critical trigger. Critical to my Vanguard, power to Brawling Jack. So 2 damage. First check, draw trigger, power to my Vanguard, draw. Second check, no trigger. Okay. 14 plus 30. Uh, 44. 44,000, 1 critical to your Vanguard. Oh my god, damage. I end my turn. Stand and draw. Uh, so more shifting to Let's sell 2, draw. I call Sanji Fushimi Hilda. I actually like um, Hilda skill from the last one. Search my deck for one. Does this one or not? All my regular sets plus 5,000 power. 12,000 to your bank. This is two pass. Okay. Yeah. First check, second check, no. Uh, oh, heal trigger. Again, 
the power to um, fusion. Okay. And you recover? Yes. Okay. The Dazuka is plus 5,000 since it was caught on the deck. Mm. So 27,000 is your bank. Oh, uh, Hugo. Yeah. No good. Damage check. I didn't kill any. This is 24,000 to your bank since I have f 4 more units. 29? 20. 24. 4. 14 plus oh, 10. No skill, right? Oh, 29. Yeah, 29. So it's still a huge trigger. Yeah. Right? How much is this column? 19, 29. Yeah, 29. Also 29. Oh, no, 39. 39. Okay. I'll go for this. Hugo. 39,000. I don't know. Damage check. Time to call you. I have my turn. Stand and draw. Right. True demonic rifle look. Gunning call you. I'll take. Protect one. And I'll activate Gunning call you skill. For the top card of that, you drop zone. Okay. So this time he only gets 5,000 power and plus. One drum. I move Brawny Jerk down and I call Unrivaled Blade Rogue Cyclone Tooth. My Vanguard will attack your Vanguard for 17,000. No way. Triple Drive. Mm. First check. Killer Leaf. Second check. Flowery Tiara. Third check. Critical Tree. Critical to my Vanguard. I'll give 10,000 power to Cyclone Tooth. So two damage. First check. Second check. No trigger. Alright, thank you guys for watching. That's the end of the second round. Bye guys. We're back with the last round. Sorry. So, between Mega Colony, Gunny Colio, and. Marco Okay, third round. We draw three. Draw one. Uh, two. Alright. Mm -hmm. oh. Two. two. Okay. Proxy will go first on uh, this round. So let's stand up. Bang. What's the goal star program? Machining work at it. Draw. Flash. CG. Draw. Button. Draw. Right. Machining hornet. Draw. Call machining hornet. 16,000 to our Vanguard. No, no. Drive check. Run check. Let me check which. Done this one. I'll activate my Vanguard skill. Top 6 cards. I can add a grade 3 into my hand. Take some promises. Into my hand. And I'll activate my rear guard machine connect skill. The VR, gunning collier to my hand. I'm really going to go into the reserve. Draw. Alright, I'll put it on. I call Jack put it on. 9,000 to me. I don't go. Draw check, quick, quick power. Let me check. First, draw trigger. 10,000 power to my Vanguard. Draw. Second check. Kill trigger. Power to my Vanguard. Recover. Then it doesn't, doesn't hit. Yeah, okay. Okay. Yeah. It's my turn. Stand and draw. So I'm going to turn right. So I write True Demonic Rifle. Uh, I'm at grade 2. I write Spear Attack Mutant Megalara Lancer. Calling Water Gang and Hiding Healer Leaf. I will also call Brawny Jack. I'll take a Brawny Jack skill, so plus one. Put a top card of the deck into a drop zone. Bring one greater, so charge one. And uh, Brawny Jack also gets 6,000 power. 9,000 to your rear guard to Kotsuko. Drive check, Butterfly Officer. Killer Leaf attacks, skill. Counter blast one, so blast one. Uh, it gets 10,000 power and put a top card with that into our drop zone. Great one and great time, you get to draw one card. 19,000. This is uh, 20, 17 plus 6, so it's 23,000. Triple card. No card. 
Okay. And this will be a trickle down. Okay. I am a Stand and draw. Alright, fantasy petal stone shariuki. Let's all to draw. I will use shariuki skill so that's two minus 10,000 for our family. So all of them are negative 1,000. I call Fushimi and another shariuki. Twelve thousand to Oh man, no god. Okay, first check, second check front. Front, uh, then check, step deeper. Nineteen thousand to Avenga. Avenga is minus one thousand. So it's a uh, fifteen god. No, it's a. Okay. Two, no, um, twenty-five k god. Twenty-five k god. How much is a regular shirayuki? Seventeen. Mm, no god. Oh, uh, twenty-seven. No god. Then check. Twenty-seven thousand power. I'll nullify the attack. It's cutting the like comma two. I am at Stand and draw. Alright, uh, first right. True demonic rifle rope. Gunning Kolo. I'll take protect one. And then put the sub into your drop zone. With one. Uh, he doesn't get that many drives, you get plus one drive and plus five thousand power. I'll take a water gang skill. When it stands, count the last one, I can put it into the soap, draw two cards. One, two. Move, one jump, up. And call small captain butterfly officer. I'll use butterfly officer skill. Rest, I can give hiding killer leaf plus 10,000 power. In exchange, it goes into the soap at the end of my turn. Uh, I think I'll call it here. Move Ron Jack down, I'll call Megalara Lancer. Okay, I'll attack with Hiding Killer Leaf first. Uh, this is 29. Okay, I use the skill, call the bus one, so bus one. I'll put the top card there into a drop zone. So, play one, we take and draw one card. So it's 29,000 to your bank. Go. Two card, that's right. Uh, 17,000 to your bank. No card. I check for my triple drive. First check, critical trigger. I'll give the power to Megalara Lancer, critical to my bank. Second check, critical trigger. Mm. Power to Megalara Lancer, critical to my bank. Third check, Ronnie Jack. First check, front trigger. Second check, no trigger. Third check, no trigger. So front trigger. Okay. Megalara Lancer attacks with the boost from Ronnie Jack. I'll activate Megalara Lancer's skill. When it attacks a Vanguard, it gets 2000 power for each of our rested rare guards. So that's plus 4,000. So right now it's at 1029 plus 4. 31. Number plus 31 plus 8. And it's 39. Yeah. 39,000. I'll activate Brawny Jack skill. He's cutting one card from your hand. You just cut one card from your hand. So 39,000 to your bank. Kill card. So at the end of my turn, Killer Lee goes into my soul, get the combo charge one. My turn. Stand and draw. Alright, Kill card. That's our two draw. I call Rainy Madam. Kill card skill. Um, that's why I switch my deck for Kyak Kipo Nana. Superior card. Okay, but skill count this one. This card I cover my hand. Superior so call. Oh no. And my whole field gets my same power. Including a Vanguard? Yeah. Okay. Oh, uh, but this doesn't get 10,000. Yeah. Return all your units back. Back to the back. I shuffle. 22,000 to a Vanguard. This is a Hugo. Oh no, it's a Vanguard. Okay, so it's a Vanguard. 22. How much is Shuriki here? 17, 27. 27. I don't know. 
Since I first checked draw to them. I give the power to um Lucky Boat. Okay. Second check France. Wow. Deadly. So one damage. Yeah. Then check. Draw trigger. How to my Vanguard? Draw one card. This is 12 plus 30, oh uh, no, 12 plus 820, 30,000 to Avenger, no, 40,000 to Avenger. Avenger is 22, so it's a Hugo. Oh, it's a Hugo. Hugo. Um, is this the lowest attack? Um, this is 34. 34 is a Hugo. 22, so it's a Trigger. Yeah, yeah. Trigger. Damage check. No trigger. 34. It is triggered. Yeah. You got a retreat. Attack the retreat or you're swinging on your skill. Yeah. Oh, Shuriki to the head. Yeah. Okay. 17, um, 17, 27, 37, 22. Hugo. Scorpio and Mantis Guts. And this is 17 plus 30, 47,000 to Avenga. How much that? Um, Avenga is 22, so it's 30k. Two triggers. Now if I hit this card. Okay. Stand and go. Hand size. 7. I write 2 demonic rifle rook, gunning code. Okay, protect 1. And you put the top card of that into your drum zone. Wait, what? Okay. He just gets 5k and plus 1 drive. I call Brony Jack. Brony Jack skill. So blast 1 card. Put the top card of that into your drum zone. Okay, it's a great one greater. Uh, he has 6000 power, and if it's a great one greater, I can so charge 1. I use my Vanguard skill. So plus one grade three, put the top card of the deck into your drum set. And you cannot guard with a grade zero. Oh no. Okay. Nice. Um, I'm gonna call Unrivaled Blade Rope, Cyclone Tooth, and Machine Stack Beetle. The Beetle skill can superior call two cards from my soul. One. I'll just call one. I call Phantom Black. Boosted by Phantom Black, guarding Collier attacks. I'll activate Phantom Black skill. This card one card from the hand. We cannot guard with a normal unit for this attack. No triggers, no grade one, no grade zeros, and no normal units. So this no is card. just 17 plus 8, 25,000. No Triple drive. First check. Hornet. Second check. Lancer. Third check. And slide. Alright, thank you guys so much for watching. Bye guys. Oh yes, and that is the last two rounds of the best of three between um, my Mega Colony Gunning Colio deck, Mill deck, and Roxy's Morokomo Hyuga deck before the ban list. Okay, so for the second round, uh, I decided to go first. And um, for this round, Roxy G assisted again. So that was really unfortunate. But I guess that's just what happens when, you know, the deck has so little like grade twos compared to grade threes but basically she just assisted she got the grade two yes but that uh cost her two cards from her hand and then for me um uh, i think i was also really lucky uh in this round so on my first grade three turn uh, i managed to mill a grade three again with gunning Colio's ability which gave him plus fifteen thousand power and plus two drives uh so i had four drives on my first grade three turn while roxy is on grade two and I checked into, you know, all three of my triggers, heals, draws, and crits. I was able to push Roxy to 5 damage before she ever reached grade 3. And then I managed to finish Roxy off on my second grade 3 turn. Uh, because she was already at 4. She got a heal, right? So she was at 4. I checked into a crit with my triple drive. And Roxy didn't got, so that's basically the end of the game. And then for the third round, Roxy went first. So my first grade 3 turn was 
Just as always explosive uh, with the triple drive, I managed to check into two critical triggers, so I dealt three damage straight. Uh, if I had checked three crits, I would have been able to finish Roxy off, but I didn't. But that was good enough. Uh, I was able to push Roxy to five damage uh, in my, on my first grade three turn. And then on Roxy's turn, she just did what she did best, uh, which is the Hyuga with Hyaki Vogue combo. That pushed me to 5 as well, but then the next turn, I rode into Garnicolio again and I managed to mill a great 0 with Garnicolio's 2nd ability, which basically means that Roxy is not able to go with great zeros. So that was one of the luckiest mills uh, in his best of 3, because not being able to go with great zeros means that all the, her perfect guards, as well as her high defense cards like the 15k shields and 20k shields, are blocked off from guarding. And not to mention, uh, I also play Phantom Black, which is a card that is able to prevent the opponent from guarding with normal units. So basically, for the third round, I won because Roxy wasn't able to guard with great zeros, which are essentially triggers, as well as normal units. So that meant that she wasn't able to guard with anything. And that's basically how I won. It's a really cheesy win, uh, really luck-based, but that's actually really one of the, you know, the ways that guarding Kolyo wins, which is by guard restrict. So yep, I hope you guys enjoyed this best of three. Definitely an interesting fight. The outcome was definitely unexpected for me. So, so thank you guys so much for watching. More videos will be coming out soon. Uh, featuring Roxy's updated, you know, Murakumo deck after the ban list. And yep, bye guys.